is the 22nd century. Humankind has become infertile. Surrounded by hostile wastelands, we struggle on the verge of extinction. But there is still hope. Last child from a natural pregnancy. to appreciate being left alone with my thoughts at night. Now it just feels haunting. I keep worrying about the future. Turning my back on everything I've believed in. Leaving my entire world behind. I have to remind myself that this is bigger than any single one of us. The child must be set free so that she can save us all. New message on my brace call. Well, I, I just received confirmation. Operation Diffuse is moving ahead. I'll be on location at 1 a.m. tonight. This is it. I, I hope you're still in, that you haven't changed your mind. Hey, Will. I'm just letting you know that I've worked out the logistics. Now, I got a hold of this boat, and it'll carry us across the trench. Then it's just a matter of passing through the temple, climbing the pipe up to the waste plant, and entering the labs through the freight elevator. Now, I think we got ourselves a solid plan here. Well, solid enough, considering the circumstances. I'll ping you when it's time to roll. Daughter, I'm sorry to bother you an hour after you left for the night, but you have to hear this. The year one reflections just passed the final tests with flying colors. That means they should be ready to wake up. What a milestone in our work. It, you know, I am so glad to have had you by my side through all of it. We should schedule a night off to celebrate. I haven't heard from you in quite a while, dear. I hope you haven't forgotten about what we last discussed. Listen, I've reissued your travel clearance to Fexus. It's valid for another 30 days, starting now. Please, make it here this time. If only for the sake of your little old mother. I do miss you. Luke will be waiting for me in the trench. We need to get there now. Oh, mother. Where did we go wrong? Best day of my life. Ignorance is bliss.
Right then, time for some hacking warm up. I'll start with the firewall hacks. We're getting you out tonight, sweetie. Maybe I'll finally be able to sleep if I get all this over with. But it won't be in this bed ever again. My art has always been therapeutic work. My compositions are never really finished, just abandoned. The cluster always intrigued me. With my leaving the stem, maybe I'll finally get to go there. This will give my cloak a boost. I wish I had more time to work on my cloak. It hasn't even been field tested. Well, no time for that now. It certainly didn't make me feel smarter. Working title. Animals I wish I'd seen. Mother. I should figure out what she knows. Oh, there you are. What a relief. I was afraid I wouldn't get a hold of you. You sound worked up, Mother. What's going on? There are reports of terrorist activity escalating in one city. I really fear for your safety, Wilona. 
Who are these supposed terrorists? It's a group that calls itself the Infrareds. You've heard of them, I'm sure. Well, these infrarats have been a pest in one city for quite some time now. And according to my intel, they are planning something big. What kind of terrorist activity? The terrorists want to tear down the society we've worked so hard to build. It seems they know exactly which strings to pull. How did you learn about this threat? Well, as minister, I have access to classified intelligence, after all. Don't believe everything you hear, Mother. I don't. That's why we only employ credible sources. Any chance we can pick this up tomorrow? Let me get to the point first. In view of the infrared threat, I've arranged for you to be escorted safely out of one city tonight. Call ended. Enough. That should get the point across. Administrator override. Willona, did you just hang up on me? Uh, sorry. The call was uh, interrupted. I see. Hmm. Well, as I was saying, there is an escort on its way to extract you. Mother, I'm a grown woman. I can take care of myself. It's not about your ability. In this family, we take care of each other. What do you think they'll say at the labs if I just pick up and leave? I'm sure they'll see that an opportunity to work in the capital was a great honor. So, you're saying I'm to work in Fexus? You're a gifted scientist, Willona. We'll put your abilities to better use. Favoring me because I'm your daughter, handing me a job, that's nepotism. Nothing in this world is fair. We all have to make the best use of the hands we are dealt. But you're cheating the system, slipping me an ace. You're really not seeing my point here, Wilona. Lockdown in effect. Seriously, Mother! I do not much care for that tone, Wilona. Our top priority is getting you out of harm's way. Your escort should arrive shortly. Everything will be fine as soon as we're together. Call ended. Mother's interference could jeopardize the whole operation. I made a promise to Luke. Can't back out now. Interesting read on how we handled the artificials. We treated them so badly. Betrayed their trust. No wonder they finally turned on us. The red leaves, a curious phenomenon. A lockdown, like that's ever going to hold me back. This shouldn't be too difficult. Just need to get the core into the dock.
all about momentum. The core is going to speed up. Let's try that again. Oops. The encryption is more advanced than it seems. Did the trick. Roll bounce. There we go. Just need to rotate the shapes to fit the outlines. Snap right into place. Satisfying. There. Got it. I've mostly ordered in. It may have been a bit too convenient. Oh, sorry about that. Can I help you? What's going on here? These delivery bots are stuck in some kind of navigational loop. Automation only gets you so far, apparently. Why don't people just start picking up their own things? <laughs> That would actually make a lot of sense. But you're going to have a hard time finding anyone wanting to do a bot's job. So why bother with automation if they can't even find their way around here? Good question. The bots lack any reasoning. Their routines are too basic. It'd be a whole lot easier if we could use sentience again, you know? But... I'll take a stupid bot over a rebellious one any day. I'm a scientist. Maybe I can help in some way. <sighs> At this point, I'm pretty much open to any suggestions. Have you tried turning them off and on again? <sighs> yes, of course I tried that. I even tried smacking them about. Mostly just to vent my frustration, though. How about opening them up? Already did. I'm sure replacing some parts would help, if I had any spares. But I'm pretty sure it's a software issue. I could try hacking the bots. I would certainly not, officially, approve of any such actions, if you catch my meaning. Shouldn't be too hard to gain access. Oh, 
That's the angle. That should do the trick. Should stay on the grid. Are you sure this is within your area of expertise? Would you look at that? Thank you. Yeah, what the bot said. Whew. You may have just saved my night, maybe even my job. It was no problem, really. Guess I should brush up on my hacking skills. Now, let's see what else I need to take care of around here. Thought I assigned a repair bot to take care of that. The bot sustained water damage. Why do I even bother? Good thing it's just about time for my break. I'll deal with all that later. Wrong way. Should head for the elevator. Mother must have sent for them. Here goes nothing. I should hack into their comms. Listen in. Pinging the source will guide me in the right direction. Need to listen carefully for the sound to clear up. There it is. Zero seven T two has arrived at subject's location. Over. This is the orbiter. Do not intervene. Stand by on site. Affirmative. Standing by. Now eyes on that door. Got it. The cloak. One new strain of full battery. Should have gotten around to that field test sooner. Hmm, to reach the elevators, I'll need to go around. Sorry, I got 
that song stuck in my head. Yeah, well, you sure butchered it. Yeah. <laughs> Need to power my cloak. Maybe I could salvage more power from that broken down bot. Error. Abstraction. Need to think strategically about this. suspicion. Thank, thank, thank you. There. Somebody's sneaking around here. Get a visual confirmation. Don't waste my time. Copy that, sir. Hmm. Can't forget my cloak. Here goes. Out of here. I'm making a run for it. Too close. What in the name of... Young lady, you better have a very good reason for sneaking around here, all invisible. Maybe she's the one who's been stirring up this whole one for swarm. I'm just taking my new cloak out for, for a test run. Test run? Haven't heard that one before. And you're saying it has nothing to do with this whole bolt situation? It doesn't. But I'm sorry for startling you. Sorry, she says. What would you be doing with a cloak in the first place? I'm quite sure that type of technology requires a license. Well, I am a scientist. It's part of my work. Wait. Are you that Willona? Oh, aye, that's right. So sorry, dear. Well, don't let us distract you from the important work you're doing. I say we still report her. Better safe than sorry. Let's think about this for a second. Implicating Minister Wilde's daughter. That could have consequences. When you put it that way, hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Hmm? I heard that the minister must be married to a scientist here in the city. That would be uh, Wilona's father, I suppose. I think so. Rumors she left the for a career. It reads Dawn anew. This one reads, left inside. You know, I always found these sculptures unknown. The inscription reads, name in memoriam. The artist, Page. I should never think his name. Always thought Page was some old man. Either way, you could. Inscription says, undercurrent. What are you on about? It's about the flesh of the human physiology carrying the structure of civilization. Of course. How can I have been so blind? This one reads, open eye. Reads, uprise. This may very well be the last time I see my apartment. Will I end up missing this life? Door closing. Please stand clear. leaving for lobby 15. Another scrambled frequency. Should be able to clear it up. The pickups will give me more moves. of moves. Safely. 
Whatever you say, Minister. Call ended. They don't seem to know I've left my apartment. At least not yet. <laughs> 